all, it's your girl Tiffany, Madam Luscious Black Beauty, your Poetic Psychic Pisces, High Priestess, aka the Light that Shine Psychic Diamonds, also known as your Modern Day Nun, one whom isn't within a coven, a convent, or a covenant. I do thank you all for listening and for watching on tonight. If you would be so kind, so please like, share, and subscribe. It would be greatly, greatly appreciated. This is going to be a general reading for the overall collective of any zodiac sign. So please take the messages that apply, leave the ones that do not, guys. Um, and without any further ado, we're going to get into tonight's reading. Also, remember that these messages can apply to your past, your present, or your future. This may be pertaining to yourself, your lover, your family, your friends, your co-workers, your neighbors, or any and everyone in between that you may or may not know. Okay? So, with that being said, guys, let's get to it. Okay? The first uh, card we have here is Greed. Okay? We have Satanic Sellouts. Systematic abuse, competition all around you, staged events, okay? Let me get these on here, guys. I'm going to try to fit them all up here, okay? So, obviously, um... Somebody is very greedy, very materialistic, okay? Obviously, all they care about is money, okay? Um, this could have something to do with uh, such person selling out, okay? Um, but there's some type of systematic abuse going on, some type of underlying abuse that's going on. A lot of competition around a person. We could be speaking to someone um, who is very popular, someone who is a celebrity, uh, uh, someone who is in the entertainment industry, okay? Um, but it seems to be a lot of greedy individuals around. I don't feel like this is about any one person here, okay? Um, because everything seems to be plural, especially when looking at satanic sellouts, okay? That's more than one person. And competition all around you, again, speaks to more than one person, okay? Um, I feel like something particularly is going on with uh, certain persons, okay? As well as a multitude of other individuals around, okay? So we have the satanic powers that be, okay? We have betrayal here, okay? So I feel like when it comes to this greed or what's going on in reference to to speaking of greed or, or, or persons being greedy in a situation, um, the satanic powers that be is behind particular goings on that's happening amongst uh, these individuals who have sold their soul to the devil which essentially means that they have sold out to the establishment, they have sold out to the satanic powers that be, okay, which means they have taken some type of satanic oath or um, or, or, or something, okay? Persons who are a part of secret societies, witch covens, satanic cults, um, and so forth, okay? But there, there's still this dynamic of systematic abuse that is going on amongst all these persons, okay? But in speaking of these satanic sellouts, okay, because you're talking about a multitude of individuals, okay, who I feel like is in the industry, in the business, competing with one another, which is the reason we have the competition all around you, okay, but with betrayal here, it seems that there's a lot of shy steam out like it's in the game, okay, other people stepping on other people's toes to, uh, you know, come up get what they want out of a situation you know to bypass someone else to have someone else she uh, shelved or on a back burner or not so you know whatever the situation may be okay because there's betrayal that is going on amongst these individuals that spirit is saying are sellouts okay a lot of greed going on it's like it's like you know having a million dollars in the middle of a field and a bunch of entertainers uh you know on all sides of this field all around and all of them are sellouts and they're all betraying one another um to all get to this million dollars. You know what I'm saying? While the satanic powers that be is systematically abusing them all and fucking over them all. You know what I'm saying? So they're all dealing with that, yet they are all betraying each other 
And it's all centered around this greed. It's all centered around the competition that's all around them all, okay? But something is staged, something which means something is uh, purposeful, being planted, set up, that's going on around them as well, okay? So we have shadow government here that sits up under systematic abuse. So you can see um, how this is playing out. You got satanic powers that be here, betrayal here, and shadow government here, okay? So, um, and when speaking of the satanic powers that be, when speaking of the, sh uh, the shadow government, we're talking about the rulers, uh, masters, um, those who run, rule, and control things from the shadows, from behind the scenes, um, that, you know, have the most, w the most wealth, power, privilege, uh, prestige, you know what I'm saying, um, in the world in which we live in here, okay? So we also have false flag here, which is quite interesting because false flag goes hand in hand with staged event, okay? A staged event is something that is um, planned, is set up, is, is orchestrated, is organized, okay? Something that is a false flag, um, it's made to appear very real, um, could be uh, uh, catastrophic, traumatic, dramatic, uh, it, you know, cause chaos or what have you, um, and seem, um, uh, every bit of scary to, uh, outside persons, those on the outside looking in, but those in the know, know that this, uh, event is staged, know that this is a false flag, and thus, um, Everybody is surprised or shocked and scared at what is going on, but it's a false flag because, I mean, take the first word, false, okay? There's a falseness to it, okay? Um, it is made to appear like an illusion. You understand what I'm saying? And then we have money here, okay? It always seems to boil down to money, which is, is not a coincidence considering the fact that we started off with greed. You understand what I'm saying? So, um... We gonna see what else is going on here. Definitely um, a lot of shicey shit. Okay, there's some staged events, false flags. It's all centered around greed. It's all centered around money. The it seems to me the satanic powers to be the shadow government is pulling the strings of of everything and everybody and kind of fucking over, you know, everyone. Okay, but we're gonna see what else is going on with this situation. Okay, guys, so, uh, give me a second to get these other cards, and we're going to pull some clarifiers and see just what's, what's really going on. So, Spirit, please clarify greed. Why is greed here? Why is greed here? Why is greed here? Some this greed here is about sudden wealth. We're talking about a large lump sum of money, a whole lot of money. This not no chump change, okay? Um, and there's a lot of greedy individuals involved. They're all trying to get their hands on this money, and they don't give a damn who they got to step on, step over, screw over, push out the way in an effort to get this sudden wealth. Spirit clarifies satanic sellouts. Okay, so uh, we have false person here, okay? These satanic sellouts are false persons. They're wearing a mask, okay? They're not who they appear to be, okay? Um, there's something uh, with these false persons. There's something very fake, phony, fraudulent about them, although they may appear to uh, the outside world like they're upstanding, they're righteous type of individuals, okay? We're talking about liars, cheaters, thieves, manipulators, con artists, okay? Because after all, we started off with greed, okay? These are individuals who are wearing um, this false mask, okay? Um and involved in a multitude of different things behind the scenes to get what they want, okay? Um, including sacrifice, okay? Including sacrifice, because on the side of that satanic sellouts card, it says sacrifice, okay? So we're clarifying systematic abuse. This systematic abuse is happening by official persons in power, uh, individuals who are high ranking, individuals who are in authority, okay, um, who abuse their power, who abuse their authority, who abuse uh, their positions, titles, and roles that they have to um, 
manipulate and control others okay to bully others into submission okay so what you have is uh, all of these persons are enduring this systematic abuse but these satanic sellouts in turn are betraying one another for the love of money greed you understand what I'm saying? Okay, so we have high honor here that sits here with competition all around you. All of them are striving for high honor. All of them are striving to be uh, the the uh, the wealthiest, the, the you know, uh, to have this highest of honor, okay? Um, thus, they are competing with one another, okay? In order to have these uh, particular positions titles roles okay it's all about wealth it's all about power it's all about status okay with what's going on here spirit what is this stage event about okay whatever this staged event that has been planned that has been orchestrated that has been organized it is meant to bring about some type of change here okay um and I feel like a multitude of individuals could be involved in this where now we're talking about persons who are in government in power and we're talking about persons who are wealthy in in power uh via the the entertainment industry okay so we're talking about various different persons on different levels with different positions titles and roles who are all aware of the staged event who are all you know have their respected roles in this staged event okay who are all within the know of what this staged event is all about. Spirit, clarify satanic powers that be. Clarify satanic powers that be. Whatever's happening here, we got, we have concern here, okay? So these satanic powers that be who, who are used to pulling the strings of all the puppets um, are sitting back in concern. Uh, pertaining to something in particular here. Spirit, clarify betrayal. Okay, so we have occupation here. So we got these satanic sellouts, these false persons who are betraying one another, okay? Um, like I said, over uh, in, in, in their, you know, their respected roles amongst the occupations in which they fall in, okay? They don't care who they got to sacrifice, who they got to knock off, who they got to step on, step over, or what have you, who they got to kill, who they got to get rid of, or whatever. Um, yeah, my gosh. As I said that, we got the coffin here that sits here with shadow government, okay? That sits under systematic abuse and in official persons here, okay? And we're talking about, we, 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 even though we're talking about people who very high ranking, I feel like the satanic powers that be is a separate group from the shadow government. I, I feel like that the satanic powers that be and the shadow government communicate directly together, work hand in hand together. They're both very high, tip top of the pyramid, very wealthy. Uh, together running, really controlling everything. You understand what I'm saying? But I feel like your gatekeepers fall along the satanic powers that be. And your shadow government are your masters and your rulers type of thing. You understand what I'm saying? Um, and they're working hand in hand together here, okay? People are being sacrificed. People are dying um, behind a particular situation that's going on. Um, And I feel like it's the, it's the shadow government who makes the ultimate decision with, with coffin falling under them. This speaks to death, okay? Um, those of them, the, the, the rulers, the masters that make up the shadow government, I feel like they're the ones who have the final say as to uh, these persons who they are systematically abusing and when they are sacrificed and when they are, are taken out and how and why and the, the, the setup, the staged event that's going to go on around it, okay? Spirit, clarify false flag. Clarify false flag. Okay, so I we have distant horizon here, okay? I feel like there is something that is being set up, that is being arranged, that's being organized uh, as we speak here, okay? That's going to happen in the near future, okay? Uh, I feel like it's going to be something very traumatic, very dramatic, maybe a catastrophic event here, okay? Um, 
but there's a falseness to it, okay? Something very big is going on here, okay? Um, this could be in, in reference to uh, political figures' death. This could be in reference to uh, uh, very high-ranking uh, entertainers, okay? But something big is about to happen, okay? There is a stage event, and it's a false flag, okay? And these satanic, there's a lot of betrayal that is going on, guys. There's a lot of betrayal that is going on. And it's gotten to the point that these satanic sellouts, these satanic powers that be, the shadow government. Um, at this point, I don't feel like anyone is safe. I feel like it's a roll of the dice as to who is next, okay? Um, and individuals know something is coming. They're sitting in expectation, waiting on something to happen. We got great fortune here that sits here with money here. Whatever these, uh, this, this, this future false flag that is to come is going to bring about great fortune here, okay? With Coffin sitting here under shadow government here, this lets me know, and, and it's, it, whatever this is, is a major Okay, so much so that it has the satanic powers that be in concern about this. Okay, this is going to be a, a, a either some sort of massacre, some sort of death of a very high ranking political figure or entertainer. Okay. And I feel so more along the line that it, it may be somebody very, very high ranking, maybe in government, in power, a political figure here. Because we have official person here. The satanic powers that be here. Because they're all our satanic sellouts, okay? Any of the, any, any, first of all, anybody that is a millionaire or higher, whether they're a millionaire, billionaire, trading, whatever, they're all sellouts. Nobody makes that type of money without being sold out to the tapes and house that be just period point blank. Nobody. Okay. But the mere fact that we have a uh, systematic abuse here with satanic powers that be and shadow government here. We also have official persons here. We're talking about very high ranking prominent figures. And we're, 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 uh, it, it very high-ranking political figures. We're talking about big banksters. We're talking about very wealthy, prominent people. This is something massive, though, okay? That's getting ready to occur in the near future. And everybody is sitting in expectation, waiting on um, this to happen, okay? Let's get some first clarification guys and see what's going on here whatever's going to go down though it i mean and, and and it's so trippy that you got greedy satanic sellouts okay false who are false persons who are literally behind the scenes in, in competition with one another for this second wealth okay but Whatever death that is to occur in the near future is going to bring in great fortune. Like a massive freaking fortune. Okay? Yeah. Massive fortune. So we have the enemy here that sits here with uh, greed and sudden wealth here. Somebody is, somebody is, is the enemy or is being seen as the enemy. In this situation here. But there's about to be. There's about to be a whole stage event set up. Around a situation. And it's going to be so dramatic. It's going to be so massive. That. Like it, it may scare the public into believing that. You know. Um, something more is going to pop off in an effort to like harm everyone, but it's being specifically staged and set up to harm certain persons in particular. Does that make sense? 
You understand what I'm saying? It's almost it's almost equivalent to being like um there's there's a, a a mass shooter serial killer on the loose in such and such area. We don't know where this person is, but everywhere this person goes, they kill a bunch of people and then they disappear and they're just out on the loose and we don't know where they're at. So to the public, they'd be like, oh my God, they're in this area. Like umpteen people was just killed over here and then they went over here and umpteen people more just died over here. This whole event has been staged, okay? But there's like this person, this all has been set up maybe to kill this particular person, okay? But other dramatic, traumatic things is happening in the process. Like it's a stage event, but something in the midst of it is false. I use that as an example, guys. This is not what I'm, I'm saying is going to occur. I just use that as a very dramatic example, but it's something like that, okay? It's something, because a lot of betrayal is going on here. It's something that would get the world's attention, to the point of being on edge, but it's being specifically set up to take out particular persons. But it may be so dramatic that it causes the masses to be fearful for a while, For if that makes any sense. You understand what I'm saying? So because to clarify, satanic sellouts with false persons here, we got money here, okay? So we know that there's a lot of money involved with a situation here, okay? To clarify systematic abuse and official person, we have death here, okay? There's a death that is about to occur, I'm telling you, of someone who is, I, I really feel like who this person is, is someone, is a very high-ranking, powerful, wealthy political figure, okay? And these, when speaking of official persons, we're talking about, um, government officials, military officials, uh, CIA, FBI officials in, in, in higher and above know this is going to occur, know this is going to go down type of thing. And we're talking about somebody very high ranking, very wealthy, like this would shake up everybody. Like this would get everybody's attention on whoever this person is to, to be taken out. Okay. Very clarified competition all around you in high honor. Competition all around you in high honor. Yeah, we got surprise here, okay? Hold on, we got two cards trying to come out with this. This is interesting. This tried to come out at first. We're going to take this. We got messenger here, okay? So I feel like particular messages, news, information, or communication has gone out to certain persons, okay? About something here, okay? About someone who is of high honor, okay? And you got all these people around this person who is, is, is either competing with this person or in competition with this person here. Those in the know has gotten this message and know that this stage event is going to go down. They, they are prepared and sitting in expectation, like I said, waiting for this to go down. This, um, whatever this stage event that's going to bring about some type of change, it's going to cause surprise, shock to the world. Okay, this is how I know that this is somebody big. This is somebody that everybody knows. Um... This is going to shake up a lot of shit. This is going to bring about a great fucking change. But there's a lot of money. There's a there's there's particular reasons and why this is being set up. This is happening. Y'all, this would be, I literally feel like the death of a president. Because it's, it's like somebody high up like that. I literally feel like the death of a president. But if not, it is definitely somebody who is very prevalent, very relevant, very wealthy, somebody that everybody knows. Whether you like or love the person, is somebody that everybody knows. This is going to be major. This is going to be like a glimpse in a matrix, like time is, is going to stop for a moment in a world where there is no time when this occurs. And there's like sudden, well, there's a lot of fucking great fortune in behind this person's death and, and what is to come thereafter. 
this is major and the satanic powers that be and the shadow government is is in on and this is major fucking betray betrayal sits right smack dead in the middle of satanic powers that be and shadow government and above that is satanic sellouts and systematic abuse this is somebody very wealthy very high up in ranking I, I i literally feel like so that this is like the assassination of a president it don't it doesn't have to be current president it could be previous president but it is somebody that high ranking that high up in power it could be but i'm, I'm telling you like this would make everybody stop and pause and pay attention to what's going on Spirit, clarify satanic powers that be. Mm -mm, this guy, this definitely got somebody in concern. This definitely got somebody in concern here. And when I look at this house here, it, it almost gives me like, like white house. Like this is creepy, guys. This is creepy. Spirit, give me, what, clarify satanic powers that be. Okay? So like I said, oh, Lord, I seen it again. I seen it again. Somebody is in concern. There's some months of satanic powers that be. They are worried about this. They are in concern about this. Okay. And this concern card got 33 on it. Okay. Uh, Master Mason number here. Okay. Something's going to go down in a house. White. The White House. Or in a house. Or, or a mansion. Something. Okay. On betrayal and occupation, we got a lord here. A lord is somebody in power, authority, of influence, a master or ruler or something. I'm telling y'all, the person who is going to die, bro, is somebody very, very high ranking. But this person is going to be murdered. This person is not dying from natural causes. Um, like this is major. This is fucking major. Like, seriously, guys. Seriously. To clarify shadow government with Coffin, we have Squalor here. Whoever this person is that's going to die, this is person is like a specialist in their field of study or either this person is, is a, whoever the scholar is could either make up the shadow government and, and, and this is going to be their death. But this person could be very knowledgeable. This person could be highly educated. This person could have degrees. This person could be an academic. Uh, a scholar is somebody who is a specialist in their particular field of study and whatever it is that they do. How this person is so wealthy and so high ranking, this could literally be like somebody amongst uh one of the 13 blood mines dying. This could be, this would be, this could be mm. this person is very high. This part of this is very high. This would be like uh, uh, a Rockefeller or a Rothschild or, 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 or someone like that passing away, okay? Or either this person is like, I, 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 I keep picking up um, president vibes. I also keep picking up the vibes of like um, somebody wants somebody taken out before the next election because they don't want somebody to run or they don't want... It, 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 y'all baby look but there's a lot of money fortune in behind this hit this false flag we're sitting here with this horizon which let us know that this is going to occur in the near future baby there is big ass fucking money around this situation and this horizon did i tell you concern is number 33 this is horizon which talks about the near future is number 36 okay three 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 six okay do I need to break down the numerology for you? Okay? Like, come on, bro. With fortune here, baby, look. Some major shit is about to go down. Okay? 
and so big and they done thought long and hard about this we got money sitting here with great fortune bro they done thought long and hard about this okay you see this person has got this scroll in their hand here okay you see how this man got his hand on his head he know that this shit is gonna be major he know that but you see how he's draped with this he's, he's in like white and yellow or whatever but he's got this red cloth draped over him this talks about blood sacrifice here Somebody is in their head about this. Somebody can't stop thinking about this. Somebody could have already received some type of communication from the higher ups. This could be the person that's going to get black sacrifice. Or this could just be somebody in the know that no, this hit is going to happen. But I feel like with, with this sitting on money and great fortune, I'm telling you, whoever this person is could never go broke in this lifetime. Got that much money. And you see how he's sitting here worried. He's sitting here with his hand on his head. It's like he has gotten some type of information that this hit is going to take place that this you know what i'm saying that this this death is going to occur bro like this is serious it's all about money i'm telling you something major is going down something major is going down and those in the know are sitting in expectation waiting for this shit to pop off y'all But like even on this happening, this occurring to a lower level person, somebody on a lower level, y'all, I'm still talking about somebody who's a millionaire, okay? Somebody on a higher level that this happening to, I'm still talking about some, excuse me, somebody who is billionaire, trillionaire status, okay? But at the very least, we're talking about somebody who's worth millions, Okay? So, uh, guys, let, let me let me pull some tarot real quick. Yeah, this is going to be this. Is, <laughs> it's got three of swords, bottom of the deck. I ain't even shuffled yet. Heartache and pain, y'all. Heartache and pain. Whatever this is, bruh, it's major. And the satanic powers that be in the shadow government is in on it. Okay, there's definitely a death that's going to occur, or multiple deaths. Okay, because this could be them coming together and in on, you know, some, some genocidal uh, New World Order massacre type of shit where, they're, they're, you know, there's going to be the casualties of a, a, a lot of civilians, okay, um, type of situation here. But the way it's looking like to me is this is the death of somebody... Very, very high ranking and empowered. Okay. Spirit, clarify greed. Clarify greed with the enemy and sudden wealth. We got sadness here. Loss with the five of cups here. This greed of this sudden wealth because of this enemy is going to bring about sadness and loss. Spirit clarifies satanic sellouts with false person and money. Okay. So we got the seven of wands. You got a whole lot of people who've been enduring a whole lot. Okay. Dealing with a lot of problematic situations, a lot of hardships, a lot of burdens here. Okay. A lot of competition amongst them here for this money, about this money here. Okay. There's about to be a major sacrifice, bro. Spirit clarifies systematic abuse. Yeah. And they're passionately moving forward on this. Like, these official persons in power have made up their mind that this hit is going to occur. That this person is going to, this person or persons is going to be assassinated. And there's, like, growth and passionate movement forward in a hurry to do it. So you clarified competition all around you, high honor, and messenger. Yeah. So there is someone who is an air sign, Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini, who know that they have competition all around them. Whoever this person is, is someone of high honor, is someone very wealthy. They received the message that some shit's about to go down. This could be whoever this person is to be assassinated. 
Um, in this staged event, could be someone who is in Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini. If this person is Gemini, I know exactly who it is. This person could be an air sign, though. This shit would be major. And as big of a following as this person has, there might be some smoke in the city, baby. Yeah. That might be some smoke in the city. Because see, a lot of people, a lot of people duck and dodge and stay in worry and, 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 you know, some type of unspoken fear of all the ones that you call thugs and gangsters and shit. Okay? But baby, it's a whole lot of Good old boys. All American good old boys. Women, cowboys, cowgirls, however the fuck you want to see them that's got their weapons legalized. Whole arsenal and they packing. And they waiting for the wrong damn thing to pop off for them to rise the hell up. It might be some smoke in the city behind this one, baby. This sage event is going to bring about a lot of shock, a lot of surprise, and major changes, and it's going to flood in a whole lot of money behind this, okay? Because of these greedy motherfuckers who is in competition with this person that they're trying to knock off, okay? They're all satanic sellouts, okay? But this is a major blood sacrifice. I feel like that's going to piss off a lot of fucking people. Yeah. Mm -mm. And this is the reason why the satanic powers that be is in concern about this shit, okay? Yeah, in concern about this person in the tire fan energy, this person who's his leader. Because, yeah, whoever this whoever this is going down with, somebody is a leader. Somebody is high-ranking, is a leader, uh, have some type of very powerful or prominent type of position or following or something. Spirit clarified that's why this betrayal is here. Somebody is about to, somebody in power is about to be betrayed and fucking assassinated. I ain't gonna lie to you. Betrayal. Sitting here with occupation and Lord death. I, I'm literally picking up and they want this done before the next election because they do not want, they either don't want this man. I ain't gonna say nothing else. I ain't gonna say nothing else. If I say anything else, y'all gonna know who I'm talking about. I ain't gonna say nothing else. But the communication went out. Swift, fast fucking communication has went out. They do not want this person in or to fuck around. And it's the very reason why all of these distractions have taken place and all of this shit is steady going on with this person. But it's not got to the nitty gritty, baby. And I feel like they about, they, they, ooh, baby. The shadow government has sent out the communication. Swift, fast communication about this person's death. Spirit, clarify false flag. Clarify false flag with distant horizon and, and, and fortune. False flag with distant horizon and fortune. Somebody may take off. Somebody may go on the run. With the chariot card here. Somebody may go into hiding. Yeah. But see, those of them, these greedy individuals, those of them who about this money, who want this great fortune or whatever, they, they want to make their hopes, wishes, and dreams come true. Like these, whoever want this done, desire this so much with the nine of cups sitting here, they want this done badly. Yeah, with the moon and the high priestess sitting at the bottom of the deck, bro, come on. These are two cards in the deck that talk about shit that's secret, that talk about shit that's hidden, I talk about occultic knowledge, higher powers, authority, secret societies, sneaky, freaky, creepy shit going on behind the scenes, behind closed doors, in darkness. The moon with the high priestess, bro, this is something massive. This is something big that's being plotted, planned, schemed, set up behind the scenes, behind closed doors, okay? There, and there's some disloyal ass individuals 
who are in on this shit, okay? This is major betrayal and deception at its finest. Mm -mm. Yeah. Okay, guys. Spirit, give us further clarification for this situation. Please clarify. Y'all, y'all know what? I didn't even pull out. Look at this. I was shuffling this deck and I wasn't even ready to do it yet. Sacrifice. Sacrifice. A sacrifice is going to occur in some way, shape, form, or fashion. I stopped shuffling that deck because I, um, I forgot to pull my other deck. Look at this shit here. Shh. Some things are best kept secret. Don't ask, don't tell. So those of them who are in the know, who know that this is going on, who knows that this is going down, um, trying to stay quiet about it. Look at this. This is the death card. This is my cold-blooded killer death card here. Somebody is going to be assassinated. Somebody's going to be murdered. This sits here with satanic sellouts, false person. Okay, put this money here. The seven of wands. Spirit, clarify systematic abuse, official person. Ace of wands. Look at this. They working in secret. This is criminal activities. This is organized crime. This is things that's hidden, witchery, ritual, secrets, what's done in the dark here. Okay? That they have decided to move forward on. Spirit, clarify competition all around you here. All this competition that's all around this person here. Whoever, whoever, the competition that's all around this person. This person, whoever this is, is the per, this person is the truth. Or this person speaks truth. Or is the clear, or is, it brings clarity. Very vocal, very blunt to the point, okay? But with the will of fortune here and this competition all around you and this high honor here, we're talking about a lot of finances, money, resources here. Okay, this wheel of fortune is turning. Stage event, spirit. Clarify stage event. Okay, then that's all you got. Partners in crime here. A whole lot of money is involved in this stage event going down. It's going to bring about a major change. Okay, and it's going to bring shock and surprise when this here go down. Okay. But all these greedy satanic sellouts that's involved in this, um, all they care about is the money here. So we got strength that's in here on the satanic powers that be with concern here. House hierophant here. These individuals, the satanic powers that be is in concern about this, okay? They're trying to stay strong in this situation, overcome, overcome some type of conflict, trying to stand their ground, maintain some type of balance. A stability in this situation here okay but they feel like that they feel like that this is taking a risk okay there's some type of risk is being taken here yeah look at this look at this the world here that sits here on betrayal occupation with Lord and death here there's been there's about to be a completion of something. Something has gone full cycle. There's about to be a completion, an end of something. Something is coming to an end for something new to begin here. Okay, somebody is being assassinated. Period. To clarify, uh, the shadow government with coffin here with scholar and the eight of wands here. We got the tower card here. This is something happening suddenly. Something happened tragic, a major upheaval. A sudden shakeup of things. This could be problems of any kind. Murder, death, harm, destruction, illness, injuries, lies, deceptions, disruptions, chaos. Okay? Distractions. Something major is going to happen all of a sudden. Out the blue. It is going to be dramatic. It's going to be traumatic. Spirit clarify false flag. With this in horizon. Uh oh, oh my gosh, guys. We got cars flying everywhere. Hold on. Okay, guys. So 
So Spirit, let's clarify this. Um, <laughs> that's crazy. Mm -mm. Some type of truth or clarity is being found out about this shit that they didn't that they they trying to keep secret. People is gonna go on the run when this truth get leaked about what they got going on. Spirit, clarify this money, great fortune. <laughs> this money with great fortune thought the nine of cups here <laughs> so we have get the we have not today satan get thee behind me okay a lot of lies misery pain deception heartache sadness sorrow manipulation going down around this situation guys okay with a death. Okay, guys. So let me pull this other this other deck. We already had sacrifice here. We already know that there is a sacrifice that is going to occur in this hit and this setup. Spirit, what else is going on with this situation? We have heartache and loss here on Satanic sellouts, false person, okay? There's going to be a lot of heartache and loss behind this sacrifice that's going to occur. Spirit, clarify systematic abuse, an official person. Okay, we got accelerated motion. Didn't I tell you they ready, set, go? Okay, with that ace of wands here, they are passionately moving forward in, 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 in full speed, in a hurry, on a situation. Spirit clarify competition all around you and high honor. High honor competition all around you. Some type of truth. I'm telling you, some type of truth or clarity or something was spoken. And there's a lot of people in competition with whomever spake this truth or brought this clarity. If this, like I said, if this is not in 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 Aquarius, Libra, Gemini person, when they spoke this truth, they was in that energy. Where they cut like a sword with the truth that they spoke. Okay? They could possibly be of another sign. Okay? If they are not an air sign. Okay? To clarify stage, event, and change, we have partnerships and alliances here. Okay? This is a Masonic handshake here on this card here, okay? We got partners in crime here, okay? So we know that there are multiple persons involved in this setup, in this hit, okay? Yeah, the satanic powers that be, the reason why they're sitting there in concern, they're in mental conflict about this, okay? This is the reason why they're trying to stand their ground and find some type of balance because they feel like this would be taking a risk. Okay, they're in mental conflict about this situation. This is the reason why the satanic power said beat, but it looks like individuals hired up. Okay, then the satanic power said beat, like those in the shadow government, has made the, the this decision. So we have obstacles and challenges here. This is here on betrayal with occupation here. With the world here, a lot of obstacles, a lot of challenges in this situation that is going on. It's very clear for our shadow government with coffin, the tower card. Okay, we got emotional loss here. I feel like this is going to sit in shock waves. Okay, people are going to be surprised by this. This is going to happen suddenly, out the blue. Spirit clarified false flag and and this a horizon. We got suffering in silence here. So there's individuals sitting back that knows this is going on, that knows this is going to occur, that knows this is going to happen, who is suffering in silence. Some type of truth, a clarity about these secret hidden things that's been going on behind the scenes, that's been going on in secret, okay? It's going to leak out, it's going to come out in some type of way, shape, shape form, or fashion. And we have conflict and defeat that sits here on money and great fortune here. But not today, Satan, the death card here. 
with thoughts and a nine of cups here. Uh, conflict and defeat. Okay. Y'all, this is a major situation going down. Major situation going down. Okay. So, guys, I do hope that this information has given you the truth and the clarity um, that you were seeking pertaining to uh, maybe things you needed questions, you needed answers for, questions you needed answers for, or just the truth and the clarity that you were seeking pertaining to a situation. Okay, guys, um, this does talk about uh, distant horizon, which usually is seen as the near future. Okay, so this isn't something that has occurred yet. This is something um, happening in, in the near future. Okay, um, so yeah, guys. Oh, let me pull from this other deck. I forgot I'd be pulling from this deck too. Real quick, guys. Spirit clarify uh, greed. Why is this greed here? Why is this greed here? I thank y'all for listening. I thank y'all for watching. Uh, if you'd be so kind to so please like, share, and subscribe. It will be greatly, greatly appreciated. Competition. Conflicts. Annoyances. Okay? Individuals competing with one another here. Okay? This is the reason why the sacrifice is going to occur. So we're clarify these satanic sellouts. Clarify these satanic sellouts. Satanic sellouts and false person. Yeah. Whoever these satanic sellouts, these false persons who are wearing false masks here, they um with the with the nine of fire here. This talks about protection, preparedness, resilience. It also could speak to one feeling defensive, feeling like they need to protect themselves. It also could uh, speak to one feeling like sa a sacrifice needs to be made. Spirit, clarify systematic abuse and official person. Systematic abuse and official person. So we got the five of swords here, okay? Or excuse me, the five of air in this deck here, okay? This talks about uh, mistakes, reassessments melodrama okay this also talks about conflicts fighting fussing cussing arguments disagreements misunderstandings here okay something is going to go down here guys we got literally competition on this side conflict on this side and sacrifice in the middle of that okay it's very clarified competition all around you and high honor I'm just seeing a star card here. Could be talking about a star competition all around you in high honor. Somebody is in mental conflict about this competition that's all around them. Having some sleepless nights. This talks about negativity. This talks about worry, stress, anxiety, depression, mental conflict. Spirit, clarify a uh, staged event and change. Staged event and change here. Five of water, disappointment, regrets, sadness, loss, misery, pain, anguish here. Okay? To clarify the satanic, uh, satanic power said be with concern. We got the ace of air here. <laughs> I'm telling you, the Ace of Swords, this is like the Ace of Swords in the traditional tarot deck. This speaks to some type of truth. This speaks to some type of clarity about something coming out here, okay? And it has these satanic powers that be and mental conflicts and in concern about a situation, okay? And there's a risk that it's about to be taken, Okay? To assassinate someone because of this truth and clarity here. Because, man, look. Mm -mm. Spirit, clarify betrayal and occupation. Yeah. A lot of people in competition with each other. Over positions, titles, roles, money, okay? And there's this loyalty that's going around. Somebody don't want someone to have a particular occupation or job. This is the reason why I keep going back to 
like I feel like some the individuals who are in on this and wants this done wants this done before the next election. Okay. We got the ten of air here that sits here on shadow government and coffin. Okay. This talks about endings. This speaks to uh ultimate betrayal. This speaks to one being stabbed in the back repeatedly, okay, by multiple persons. Okay. A lot of air energy here. Fair clarify false flag. This is a horizon. We got the four of air here. Somebody is going to be injured. Somebody is going to be hurt. They may or may not die or either multiple persons are going to be killed here. With these four swords here, this could be four people who is set to be assassinated here. Some are going to die and somebody is going to be injured, but they're not going to die. Because the four swords also can speak to death. It's used on the tradition. In the traditional tarot deck, it literally shows someone who's looked like they laid out on a slab or laid in a coffin and their hands crossed across their chest. They literally look dead, okay? But the four of swords can also speak to recovery, healing, meditation, recuperation, contemplation, okay? Um, but it also speaks to somebody being hurt, injured, in pain, dying. You understand what I'm saying? as well spirit clarify um, money with great fortune and it mm -mm, yeah well wow, two cards want to come out there so with the page of air here I uh, usually this is seen as um, a gossip rumors card okay but it still speaks to truthfulness nonetheless it's just kind of cutthroat and ruthless it just comes out very bluntly okay um so this page of air so there could be talk going on about this a lot of rumors a lot of speculations a lot of uh, they, because and that could be and see this is the reason why you notice right here with this money here see this is going down is going on for a particular amount of money there's going to be more than one person who would have been set up to be taken out, okay? That's the reason why we have conflict here and defeat. Somebody is just going to have a conflict that they're going to have to get over in this situation. Somebody is going to be completely defeated. And this is the reason why we also had not today Satan get the behind me. So somebody is going, there's going to be like an assassination attempt, but this person is not going to die. And then there's somebody who is going to die. Or somebody may be near death or whatever, but they may not die right away. They might take them out later in, in, in the hospital or something like that. But this shit is major, y'all. Y'all don't even understand. Y'all don't even understand, okay? But this is going to send shockwaves, like, all over. People are going to be shook by this, Okay? And we got a lot of air energy here. The Ace of Swords, the Ten of Swords, the Four of Swords, the Page of Swords, the Nine of Swords, okay? And got nothing but fives around it, practically. You got the Five of Wands here, the Five of Swords here, the Five of Cups here. Competition, conflict, sadness, loss, okay? The Nine of Swords talks about mental conflict. Negativity, worry, depression, anxiety, stress, sleepless nights, okay? Ace of Swords talks about truth and clarity. Ten of Swords talks about betrayal, deceit. Four of Swords talks about uh, uh, pain, healings, recoveries here. And the Page of Swords, or excuse me, that was a Four of Swords. The Page of Swords still talks about um, like um, a blunt, brutally honest truth, truthfulness, analytical, outspoken, cutthroat to the point type of energy here. 
There's some fire signs, Sagittarius, Aries, or Leos, who's very prominent to the situation, okay? Who I feel like is calling the shots. There's a, there's a fire signs. There's fire signs who's high-ranking in power, who's calling a lot of shots around what is going on here. Yeah. That is in competition for this money or something that is going on, okay? But there's multiple persons involved, so you really can't put it. And that's the reason why we haven't had much... Face cards came out. The only face card I've pulled from practically two different tarot decks. The only face cards that we've had come out is air sign. Okay, so if the uh, or inner air sign energy. So if the person is either a person is an air sign, an Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini that is going through this, that is dealing with this. But or if this person is not an air sign, Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini, this is somebody who is brutally honest, who is cutthroat and ruthless and sharp at the tongue. Who don't beat around no bush, who don't sugarcoat shit. Okay? Who comes direct with it. That can slice and dice with that sword. You feel me? Um, so guys, like I said, I do hope that this information has given you the truth and the clarity that you were seeking. Um Wow. Um that's literally the only, and out of the other tarot deck, that was the only face card we got. Was that King of Swords that came out. And that's the reason why I said, and this came out right here on, uh, which talked about competition all around you with high honor. And the truth card came out here with it, okay, with the will of fortune here. So whoever this person is has a lot of money, okay, and is held in high honor or is in a position of high honor in some type of way. But there's competition all around this person. So if this person is not, if this person is a air sign. And if this person is an air sign, I know exactly who the hell it is. As a matter of fact, I know a couple, a few, rather, air signs. The satanic powers that be got their eyes on. It's on a chopping block. And 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 the, the crazy part about it is they're all Geminis. But like I said, if this person is not an air sign, when they speak, they carry air sign energy. That's how they come across. If this person is not an air sign, okay? But in this deck here, here, this deck, um, And this deck here, it's like a, a tarot deck slash oracle deck mixed together, okay? These are archangel messages, but there are still tarot cards that come out. They're just, they just come out different, okay? Like the five, it's the five of fire, the, the, the five of air, the five of water, okay? So that would be like wands, swords, cups in the traditional tarot deck here, okay? But we have one, two three, four, five, six, okay? Air sign cards here. Five of swords, or five of air, which is swords, okay? Five of air, nine of air, ace of air, 10 of air, four of air, page of air, okay? So if this person is not an air sign, which I strongly believe they are, but if they're not an air sign, when they speak, Whatever truth and clarity that they have spake, it cuts sharp like a knife. And they can come off like an air sign. If this person is of a, another sign, okay? But they're, I mean, with what's going on, they got fives all around them up here. You got the five of wands, the five of, uh, or the five of swords, the five of cups. In between that, you got the nine of, of wands or the nine of fire in this deck here. Down here, you got the eight of coins surrounded by nothing but air sign energy here this is like somebody's in competition for somebody's fucking job like no bullshit and we got occupation sitting here somebody is in competition for somebody's job or they don't want somebody to get a specific type of job and i literally heard spirits say they want this done before the next election so if this is possibly somebody who is saying 
was going to run for the election, they're trying to knock this person off before they can even put their bid in to say if they're going to run or even be amongst those who are going to run. Type of shit here. It, it, and if, it, like I said, and if it's not that this is this, this bruh, this would be an existing president, a previous president, but this is somebody who is as powerful and influential and wealthy as a president, if not even above them. Okay, because you got the satanic powers to be, you got the shadow government here. Whatever the fuck is going down, the satanic powers to be is some cold blooded ass motherfuckers. You understand me? They call hearted like a bitch. Okay, but this shit got them in concern. They feel like this will be taking a damn risk. This is going to shock the freaking world. The the world hasn't seen an assassination like this in like so fucking long. Like, bruh. This right here that's going on, like, literally brings me the fuck back to Kennedy. Like, seriously. No bullshit, y'all. I'm serious. And if this is not a president, current president, or previous president, this is somebody. I'm telling you, whoever this is, they are millionaire, billionaire, trillionaire status. Period. Whoever they are, I feel like they are high ranking. But there's, there's other people. It seems like there are other people. There is somebody, there is a main somebody. That seems like the establishment want to sacrifice. But there's like other people. Who, I don't know, is going to get caught up in the crosshairs or the crossfire or, or, or connected to or something. I feel like. Could be knocked off as well. This is major. Y'all, so like, I'm going to leave that alone. I'm just going to, I'm just going to leave that there alone, okay? Um, I hope y'all, this gave y'all the truth and the clarity that you were seeking, okay? If you would like to contact me, you could do so at tiff.diamond.36 at gmail.com. Um, y'all can follow me on Instagram at shine bright like a diamond36. And for those of you interested in donating to the channel, you can do so uh, through Cash App, which is dollar sign Tiff Diamond 36, or through PayPal, which is paypal.me slash at 36 Diamond. As always, guys, take care of yourselves, take care of each other, but most of all, take care of your baby, Sonny. Remember, this is a wicked, wicked world that we live in. There is wickedness in high places and there is evil that is lurking around each and every corner, even in a neighborhood near you. So y'all watch your surroundings, watch the, the company you keep, watch the surroundings in the company in which your children are in as well. And consider the fact that you never know when someone may betray you, backstab you, try to hurt you or harm you, honey. Keep you some protection on you. Y'all stay awake, stay aware, stay vigilant, and stay prepared because if you stay ready, you ain't got to get ready, baby. Until the next time, peace love and light namaste i am that i am created in the image of god guys um i meant to tell you all the cards at the bottom of the deck here so we have soldier here we have expectation here y'all i'm telling y'all whatever this is this is major okay this could even be more than one person's this is something massive going down okay if this is not some type of elaborate setup to to happen to the masses somewhere to take out, the, you know, and, 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 and multiple persons are going to die, this is someone very significant in power going to be assassinated. And the military is literally sitting in expectation waiting on this shit to pop off, guys, okay? Um, with soldier in expectation and then other people who are uh, in the know, you got persons who are trying to stand their ground in a situation or somebody is standing their ground, trying to stand their ground in a situation here. But there is with the moon at the bottom of this deck here, there's a whole lot of sneaky, freaky, creepy shit that's going on behind the scenes, behind closed doors in darkness. Okay. A lot of things that's being done in secret. Okay. Um, Yeah, so I would definitely say whether you are a political figure or whether you are somebody high ranking in the entertainment industry, um, I feel like who either either the persons involved or whomever this is going to directly affect 
are wealthy persons in power. Okay? The only other way that this could go is this is wealthy persons in power um, who are partners in crime and know that there's a major stage event that's going to go down that's going to kill regular, everyday, average Joe civilians. Okay? Um, and they're sitting in expectation waiting for this to pop off and this is going to bring in great fortune and, 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 and change and all this other kind of stuff behind this. Or either this is certain persons in power who are in competition with each other and other persons in power and wealthy that they want to assassinate and knock off and thus this is going to happen. But this is going to send shockwaves. This is going to bring about a lot of surprise, a lot of shock. This is going to happen suddenly. Just all of a sudden, at the blue, breaking news. Peace, love, and light, guys. Namaste. I am that I am created in the image of God.